So Joe, uh, our food waste machine. So we know how it works from a consumer point of view. People bring along their food waste, put it into the machine. But you te can you fill me in a little bit more about the background? What happens behind the scenes in the machine? Yeah, so basically this is a, this is a CX-5 uh, digester uh, built by ourselves, Harp Renewables. Uh, we're based in Kenston County Mead. Uh, this machine is able to process 5,000 litres of food waste uh, per week. Um, and simply, quite simply, basically, it's an accelerated form um, of processing food waste. Very like, very like compost, but obviously we have the ability to control all the conditions like uh, aeration, uh, rotation, uh, airflow, uh, and then heat. Uh, and simply, the the machine is fed. Uh, in this instance here, in in, in Navan Recycling Centre, it's fed by the bin tipper, which feeds the, the food waste into the first chamber. And then uh, it gradually then works its way down to the chamber while it's breaking down uh, to the output side of the machine where it outputs uh, the dry, stable end product, which is very much like compost. A uh, little bit different than compost in the fact that it has huge uh, value in terms of nutrients, um, in terms of uh, carbon, uh, organic carbon and uh, organic matter. And the whole idea of, of having it here basically is that by source segregating your food waste at home, uh, we're getting a much cleaner product. We're not getting cross-contamination with plastic, metal, glass, and tin cans and things like that there. So that, that makes it a much cleaner process yeah. and a much cleaner end material that can, obviously has huge value and potential as to be reused uh, back into the soil. Okay, so it's going to be a soil enhancer, so it's a real closed loop system. Exactly, yeah. yeah it's, it's very much a very kind of, you know, the, the big word at the minute is, is circular economy and this whole closed loop effect. Um, and that's exactly what we're doing here. So the food waste now, you, we know that by going through this machine and processing it correctly, that it's going to end up in the right stream, as in going back into the soil or being reused as a soil enhancer or, or a soil amendment of, of some sort. Okay. And um, from a climate perspective, and, a, and say get dangerous gases and all that, how does that work and what are the benefits? Yeah, so we, we have a very special enzyme that's, that's uh, put into the machine at the start. Um, of the process, uh, that enzyme is actually able to to mitigate those emissions in terms of forcing the pH down, which obviously controls the the release of ammonia. So, like we're standing beside a, a fully functioning machine, you know, what I mean, there's no odor. Uh, we have no issue with odor because we're controlling ammonia. So, ammonia is obviously is, is one of the greenhouse gas emissions, uh, and we know from a lot of the data that we're building up uh, within HARP that we're actually capturing an awful an awful lot of the uh, uh, CO2 in the form of carbon. Um, so our carbon, organic carbon fraction in our end material would be, would be very high and that's a, that's a great story as well for any, any business or any customer basically that's, uh, that wants to sequester carbon and get it back into the soil in terms of being part of that, uh, whole, that whole carbon circle as well. Yeah. yeah, okay. So there's great benefits and there's great benefits to households from using it, I presume for businesses, anybody in Absolutely, the food business yeah. is yeah. an ideal yeah. solution. Yeah, we, we, we have a lot of customers in the in the hospitality sector we have a lot of customers now in the corporate world all interested in it you know what i mean from residentials um you know to hospitals uh, the prison service all this kind of stuff like so it has huge application anywhere basically food waste is produced uh, we have a solution to be able to deal with 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 their problem in varying sizes and exactly yeah and you yeah. make these in county mead that's right we make these they're fully manufactured designed by ourselves in kenston county mead yeah Great. yeah